Hey there everyone, this is Chef M MKT, almost screwed that up there, and welcome to Let's Play Chantelise, A Tale of Two Sisters. Now before I start off, I should go to Options. I'm gonna lull this, yeah about that, that should be alright. Match your speed to fast, okay. Now this game was just released on Steam earlier today, which I am really excited about because I was looking forward to this game after I played Reseteer. Now a little thing you need to know about this game is that this game and Reseteer were originally developed by Easy Game Station and they were in Japanese. Now Carpe Folger, I hope I pronounced that right, translated these games into English and released it on Steam for the Western audience, which is really fantastic because Reseteer was a really fun game and if you haven't played it yet, I recommend you do, or at least look up what it is about. You may be interested, and hopefully Chantilly's has something very quirky about it that I really like. So, with that said, let's get started. Start the game. And as you can see here, I played around a little bit, so I'm just going to delete that. Yes, I would like to delete that to make it look like I'm playing blind. Slot 2, new game. Oh man. Okay, now loading. I'm just going to be quiet for the intro part because I really like the music here. Tsukiが赤い夜は外に出ちゃいけないよ。魔女に呪われてしまうからね。そんな音際な詩をよく聞かされたっけ。5年前の月の赤い夜。私たちは外にいた。まるで何かに誘われるように外を歩いていた。そんなに歩いていないはずなのに、周りは知らない景色だった。不安で泣きそうな私を姉さんはずっと励ましてくれた。ふと前を見ると、赤い月に照らされて
<gasps> Gasp! You offended your fairy sister! <laughs> oh, she is so feisty. I like that. Oh no! Is someone in trouble? Oh no! I think I need help! You think you need help? Really? I question this. Oh, yep. Yeah. Thank you, Chante. Totally! Let's go! Yeah. Oh yeah, it's been a while because I really haven't played it that much. Nope! Oh, okay. Force tutorial! Thank you, game! Press button 1 to swing your sword. Um, there we go. Press button 2 to jump. Um, locking on. Uh, that button. There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh. That's like Z targeting in um, Ocarina of Time. That's cool. Hit the camera button again. Oh, we can switch. Cool. Um, you can hold the camera button down to cancel. Okay. Yep, I'm using the gamepad. Jump step. Um, block. Okay, so that's my dodge move. Cool. Yeah, let's go kill some slimes. Yeah. It's like a, it's really like I'm playing Rad Rock on my world. We have 2D sprites in a 3D world, and those slimes are poor rings. Good times, good times. All I need is a hat. Oh, that was a bit of a pickle, wasn't it? You just appeared out of nowhere. You didn't even do anything, Chanta. You just explained how to use my buttons. You didn't actually do any fighting, so screw you. Yeah, I like a reward. Ooh. Ooh. I like where this is going. Oh, yeah. It's... PERFECTLY FINE, in all capitals. We should totally go. Hey, oh, okay, your name is Ira. Fantastic. <laughs> I like how she just explained it like that. So cute. Yeah, let's go get the food. Nomaros. Oh. You can use magic. Well, that's cool. Magic stone, see is magic. That makes perfect sense. Grab the stone. Now press that button to fire. Ooh. Color-coded elements. That's cool. Makes perfect sense. Oh, hello. Um, one, two. Uh, charging. Fire! Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, you can only use two. I wonder how many you can use at the end game. That'd be really interesting to see. Oh yeah, I can't wait for that. Oh, okay, that's no biggie. Oh man, there's time to kill some slimes. Yeah, take that. Oh no, oh, give me that. Targeting! Fire! Yeah! Uh, here you go, slime. Eat that. Alrighty, now I can actually go explore. Oh, hello there, Green Gem. Doop, 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 doop. Now, now I actually have time to explain things instead of just sitting here reading text and so on. I can now actually explain a little bit in more detail why I find this so exciting. Now, Reseteer was a very interesting game in the sense that I can only pick up six stones at once. Okay, I'll just fly off that one. Um, do that. Anyway, as I was saying, Reseteer was a very interesting game because its gimmick was that your main character is an item shop owner, an item shop owner, and you had to pay off a debt. So the whole entire game, or at least the gimmick part of the game, was that you had to make money by selling items to adventurers, which popped in from time to time. Which is really interesting because, oddly enough, it's a lot of fun making money. <laughs> and of course the game was really cute too, so that's also another bonus point there. 
It also had a combat dungeon crawling system as well, but it was the item shop gimmick that really pulled me in, to be quite honest. Hmm. Now, I guess uh, let's try some spells. Um. Oh my god, you can combine elements. Holy crap. Holy crap. Well, this game just got a whole lot more interesting. It's like freaking magical. You can combine elements to get different effects and different spells. That is really cool. Um, hey there, Mr. Slime Guy. Can I kill you? Thank you. Can I hit trees? You can hit trees and they drop stuff. Yeah. Um. Oops. Hammer ball. Cool. Oh, that's really neat, eh? Alright, slimes. Last. I think this is the last group. Die. Take that. Why'd you die? There we go. Now, there's this one gimmick in this game which may be really, really annoying for perfectionists like me. Or people who have OCD. Now, be warned, this will shock you. But in each room in the game, there is a secret chest that you can actually unlock. And to actually to get it, there are different conditions for each room to make it appear. In this first room, you actually have to kill all of these slimes. The problem is, so your melee attack at this stage will do zero damage. So in order to actually kill these slimes, you need to use a spell. So let's go charge it up, yo. Hopefully I can get all of them together. Slimes, could you stop moving for a second? That'd be great. Oh no. That's a problem. <laughs> that didn't go out as planned at all. I can't be I'll be back for you, slimes, later. Stop targeting. There we go. Um if I recall, I know that ice works. Not quite sure about other elements. Uh, da, 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 do, do. Oh dear, this is going bad. This is going very bad. Okay, I'll go get those slimes later. I just want to get to town and continue on with the next part of the game. Does that sound great, Patchouli Mouse Cursor? Yeah, man, because this is totally boring right now. Shut up, dude. Alright. Chapter 1 The Fairy and the Swords Maiden. Oh, yeah. I also really like all the artwork in this game, it looks really nice. Oh, hey there, Ira. Sure, we'd love to come in. Hey there. Oh, you run an item shop. That's fantastic. Aww. Ooh, I want dinner. I actually want it right now. It's like almost 10 o'clock in. Oh my god. The game actually has a picture of what the dinner is served as. Wow, wow, wow. So we have some bread, got some kind of meat here, got some cheese, what appears to be some cookies, got a nice fresh salad right here, got some more meat, got some soup, got some what appears to be some kind of sushi and dipping sauce, I think that's soy sauce, we have some tea, and to finish it all off, a nice little vase with a little flower for decoration, and a nice tablecloth. Seriously Ira? You have outdone yourself. That looks really nice. I want some food now. <laughs> Holy granola. Look at the spread. Yeah. I don't think she actually says Holy granola in the um, Japanese version, but whatever. Yeah, I guess that's true in a way. Well, I don't know. I prefer eating by myself, but that's just me. Yeah. Let's eat, Nomoros. But wait, you should check if the food's been poisoned. Yep, we've been looking for a witch. Well, that's really convenient. Oh, useless NPCs. This is wonderful, in all capitals and exclamation point. And exc exclamation point is in italicized font. Oh my god, it's that good. I'm just going to guess that Chante is one of those um, gourmet type characters that loves to eat food. Oh yeah, look at that description. 
Wow, I don't think anyone actually describes things like that, but what the hell, it's a game, I don't care. It makes it entertaining. I'm sorry, what? I was not aware slimes had organs. More particularly, liver. I was under the impression that slimes behaved more like, um, what do you call them? Prokaryote cells or eukaryote cells, like just a single cell, not like an actual living complex entity. <laughs> oh, that's nice of you. See? I told you you should have checked for poison. You never know what might happen. <laughs> Oh, that was hilarious. Yeah, that's always a kicker for you, Chante. Oh! <laughs> what a nice compliment. Time to get down to some real detective work. Gotta get that magnifying glass. Gotta grill the locals for some info. You heard the lady. Let's go grill some NBCs. Hey, the old man. You know where the witch is? Do you know where the witch is? Damn it. Screw you, old man. You suck. Yeah, she has been so forgetful. You're useless. Yes, yes I do. I suppose we're on the same line of work. I guess. Oh, you're just repeating yourself. Hey there, birdies! Oh my god, did you see that? The birds are here. When you get close, they fly away. Wow. I just love the little details um, games have like that. It really shows that the developers put a lot of time and effort and thought into the games for all the little tiny things like that. And I can jump in the fountain! Yeah! I even like the little water sound effects they have there, that's so cool. Can I jump on top? I bet I could... Yeah, I can jump on top. I am the queen of the world, yeah! Time to jump off. Okay, let's get back to um, the witch hunting, yo. Hey there, dude. Okay, I'll try to enjoy myself. Okay, so you're like the carpenter or something. Yeah, now you're just repeating yourself. Goodbye, NPC. Hey there. There we go. Now I can see your face. I like how you can move around. Hello. Ooh, really? Uh-huh. So you actually know something? You actually didn't tell me anything. Hey there, guy. I'm sorry. Don't talk to my sister that way. She is not a bug. Um. Um. No, you may not touch my sister. Go away, you're, you're really creepy, kid. You're really creepy. Um, I think that's all the NPCs. Let's just go back to Ira. Nope, NPCs were totally useless. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Do, 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 do. Fortune teller, okay. Oh. Fine, let's go sleep in your room. Man, she really must be lonely. <laughs> oh well, that's fine I guess. Oh man, a real bed! What I've been like, what, sleeping outside in the open? Jeez, must suck for these two. It's morning now! <laughs> I like how she popped in just normally and then um... Chante like slowly made her way back to her position and she's all like sleepy face. That is so fantastic. I love this. Sure, sure, right, bro. Yes, yes, you are. Go into the fortune teller. <laughs> Ookie dook. Oh, she actually tells me where the fortune teller house is. Thank you, Ira. Okay. Let's go to the fortune teller's house and hopefully find that witch. Time's a wasting. Come on. Oh no. Currently out. <laughs> that is so convenient. The one NPC that you're looking for, she's not there, or he's not there. Drip, drip, drip. 
currently out at the Terran Ruins for Reagents. Oh look, Terran. Hopefully there are no Marines or Marauders there. Herp de derp derp. You're welcome people that play StarCraft 2. That was a really bad reference. I'm sorry, you should just ignore that. Hey there. Oh. Whoa. Okay, so this increases attack, but look at this next part. You can multi-equip. This game is so interesting in so many ways. Well, since I actually can't buy any of this stuff, what can buy shield? But I don't like having defense. I like having max HP. Give me that. Now I have no picks. Also, do note that when you actually when I actually bought this, the price in, the price doubled. So yeah, that's uh, no, I don't want to buy that. So talk. Yes, I love that job too. Okay, goodbye. Let's go to the Terran Ruins. But I think, yeah, I think I'm gonna stop this video here. But just quickly for a second. Menu, spell list. The game will actually tell you combinations, which is really nice. Fireball, Aqua Splash, Thunderball, Hammerball, Cluster Bomb, Icicle, Edge, Blitz, Super Armor. Now do note that um, you can also get combinations of two different elements like fire and water or water and fire and it will have different effects so I'll probably experiment with that in the next part but of course I will not do that yet because I think that's enough recording for today yes yeah, definitely enough recording for today I just want to do this much just to give you guys a little taste of what Chantelise is all about because I think this is a really rad game and I suggest you go buy it on Steam because it helps support um, small developers like this to translate Dojin games. I want to see more Dojin games up on Steam because there are some really nice gems out there. So hopefully more more games like this will pop up in English, make it more available to the Western audience. Okay, so that's it. I'm done for today. Now hopefully I'll have some kind of schedule um, sorted out where I can actually go, hey, today is this day. I should go do a let's play of this game yeah because uh, there is one more game that I've been requested to do and I need to get around to doing that hopefully sometime later in the week all right that is all for today for Chantelise see you guys next time oh before I forget save the game data that would be a good idea chef MKT you don't want to do this part again that would be horrible I totally did not do that before wink wink okay now I'm done see you guys next time